Let's play video games! Hello and welcome to Rude Joystick Gaming. Um, as you may have known if you keep up with my uh, update videos, the channel name has changed. So we are no longer hard on gaming, we are the Rude Joystick Gaming. Uh, so I'm going to be doing things a little bit differently. Uh, I'm not going to have Minecraft uh, today because I'm still testing out uh, one of the mods, or at least a couple of mods, and uh, I haven't really thoroughly tested it yet, so that's that's a mod spotlight that is in the works. Um, I got other stuff on the way. Uh, Binding of Isaac, may not be uploading that to the channel anymore, I might just, just exclusively do that on Twitch, just because I think it would have a better flow to it. Um, as opposed to like releasing it episodically uh, that's what I think at least so uh, with that said this is I can't escape darkness um, I have not played this game yet uh, do you wish to play the tutorial um, no I figure the tutorial probably isn't necessary we recommend playing in a dimly lit room with your speaker or headphone volume turned up Options allow maps, sure. Allow saves, nah, fuck that. Please move the slider to set the brightness so that the box below is just barely visible. Well, I don't want it to be too dark because that's going to be a pain in the ass. Okay. So this game, it's a, a dungeon crawler. It's roguelike. Um, oh. Okay. Oh Jesus! The fuck. Um, it's it's made in very simple graphics, and in fact, I actually really like the graphics. For as simple as they are, uh, it works. But I'm I am a sucker for for old style graphics. Uh, okay, so we can move around. Uh, this game is a set. Oh, what the hell is that? Something green there. This game is essentially like Grimrock, if you're familiar with that game. Um, I just had to adjust the height on my microphone a bit. So the game is like Grimrock. I don't know if it's turn-based or real-time strategy. Because Grimlock was kind of a mixture of both. Um, oh. Welcome, unfortunate one. I am distressed to see you have fallen into the darkness. There is no escape from this tomb. Indescribable darkness lurks within. Despite this, I will try to assist you. You must venture deep into the dark if you wish to reach the light. Heed my advice, and you may yet live. Descend to the next level. There I will speak to you again. Move with care, as I cannot save you should you meet with peril. Descend to the next level. Okay. I'm a bit unnerved by those noises. Um, I guess I can... I guess I can, like, pick stuff up. Oh, yeah! Alright, how do I, like... Can I put... Oh, I think I just put it in my inventory. Can I pick up that one? Oh, okay. Can I pick up that? So, the controls are pretty simple. You got controls to uh, look around. Basically just turn left and right. Uh, you can move forward and backward. Oh, shit. Alright, so that, that is totally locked. Um, oh. What did I just do? Oh shit! Oh, okay. Uh, oh, it's a rat. Um, slip in the inventory. Let's uh, equip a spear. So that is equipped in. Oh, there's claw marks on the on the. There's claw marks on the stone there. What is this? Uh, looks like a bronze brazier. 
The sconce is carved in the shape of a snake, and its eyes are glowing. Okay. Uh, so I have a right equip, and I have a left equip. Ooh. Ah, I got a flashlight. I'm not sure. Ooh. I see a rat. I think I might have to attack it. Oh. It just, what? It just laid down. Okay, it's going the other way. Alright, so maybe it's afraid of me. So that, that's actually good. Um, there is a pit there. I guess I don't want to step on that. That might be a very short playthrough. Ooh. Uh, oh, rats. Oh, shit. Ah! Ah! Fuck! Jesus Christ. That got intense all of a sudden. Holy shit. It's not going to be like this the whole time, is it? Uh, hopefully this... This may fade. Uh, so like with... A uh, Le uh, Legend of Grimrock. Uh, there are things... Alright, I guess I can't... There are some walls that I can break through, I know that much. Because uh, it did show that in like, the... What was it? The uh, fuck the trailer. They have a trailer for this. Um, so there's buttons on all sides of this column here. I'm a bit cautious to press any one of them. Uh, there's cobwebs. Can I actually like? Can I attack that? No. All right. Alright, so I can actually just walk through that. Uh, what is this? The urn is empty except for ashes. Uh, this place looks like a cave in any minute. Okay. Ooh, that is real fucking dark. Oh, look at that shit. What the hell? Alright, I guess I don't want to go in there. Because that is like... That is pitch black. That is a hole. I think there was a spider in that web. What the fuck? What is that thing? Ooh, there's vines all over the place. Can I pick up? No, can't pick that up. Uh, another bronze brazier. Okay. Uh, can I pick up that? A bluish mushroom. Pick it up. Let's put it in our inventory. What? What is that? Excuse me? Can I attack you? Hello there, eyeball. Oh god, I can poke the eyeball. Oh. Okay. Alright. Uh, that is well and truly disgusting. Oh, that is a pit. It is a good thing I checked. Uh, okay, let's take that, put it in our inventory. I have to wonder if, like, maybe I can find a uh, something or another, like a lighter, and I can actually uh, see. Uh, can I look at that? No. Oh, the urn is empty. Okay. So I can't do anything with that. Another blue mushroom. Let's put it in our pack. Uh, 
And I guess there are some walls that will have like secret stuff on them. I cannot pick up that. Yeah. Oh, there's a. Oop. There's another rat. And I think there's another eyeball thing. Oh. Let's see, is it gonna come for us? Oh, it's gonna avoid us, I think. Oh god, there's that fucking eyeball. That is so fucking weird. I see you too, eyeball. Yeah. Uh oh. My flashlight's flickering. That. Ooh. That I don't think is a good thing. I don't know if there's like. If it has batteries that just run out. I think that might be the case. I'm trying to see if I can, like, notice anything, like, hidden on the walls. But, maybe not. Um, what do we got in our pack? We have a bluish mushroom. Just a bunch of bluish mushrooms. But there's two different kinds. So I wonder, like, which one is which. Ooh, and there's some, uh... Oh, shit. There's a rat. I see you. Well, let's try and attack it. Yeah! I guess I can't pick it up. Um... I wonder if I can, like, break this thing. No? No, I don't think so. Uh, I haven't seen anything, like, any secrets. Or maybe I'm just not very observant. Uh, look. There's lots of vines everywhere. The vines are screwing me up, because I don't know if there's going to be, like, something hidden in the vines, or what. Those vines are, like, protruding from the wall. Yeah. Actually, I wonder if I might have to place weights on these things. Uh, let's see. Maybe put a rock in it. Can I? Can I do that? No. I guess not. Okay. So let's uh. Carry on. There are claw marks like everywhere. I guess I actually have to go into the darkness. Ooh. Ooh, there's some creepy noises. Ooh, I don't like that. Oh shit, what is this? Uh oh. I hear skittering. I think it's just the rat. So I think the longer I'm in like those really darkened areas, the more my flashlight will start to go out. So I have to kind of like hurry through them. Possibly. So this is pretty interesting. I've not actually played games like this too much. I've played a little bit of The uh, Legend of Grimrock and it was pretty interesting. I don't think I've ever completed it though. At one point I should have to do that. But uh... I think at the moment... 
this should suffice. Oh, there was a dead rat there. That has me a little bit worried. Oh, wait a minute. Can I pick? Oh, yeah, I can pick that up. All right, let's put that in my pack. So, yeah, this, this is like a mixture of uh, real-time strategy and turn-based. Because movement is like turn-based, but... Um, ooh, there was a spire. But actions are like in real time. So pretty interesting stuff. And I've been recording for about 15 minutes, so I'm going to have to cut the video here. This has been... Oh. fucking weird. I wonder if there is any significance to that. Oh, more mushrooms. Let's put those in our pack. So yeah, I'm probably going to come back to this. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, this is back where I started. What the hell? Fuck. So I basically went around in a big circle. I didn't actually have to go through that really spooky path. Oh shit, it's another one. I might have to go through this. Alright, so yeah, I'm going to cut the video here. This has been pretty interesting. It doesn't look like too bad of a game, uh, despite the uh, really simplistic graphics. So I'll probably come back to it. I don't know if I should come back to this like episodically or if I should do this like twitch streams because uh I think I think episodic stuff is a lot better for YouTube because you can release it in episodes but for anything where it's not really episodic um, streaming would probably be that probably be the best option so until next time take care internet I will see you in space <laughs>